The Russian military has been offered the opportunity to evaluate a Russian-made combat exoskeleton at the Defense Ministry's first ever Innovation Day, where defense scientists demonstrated their emerging technology. This device allows an ordinary soldier to emulate normal human capabilities, allowing one person to carry up to 100 kilograms with minimal effort. The system is all mechanical and contains no batteries or electric motors. If we block the knee joint, immobilize it and put this load on the soldier, it will be the framework that carries the load, not the soldier. While the knee joints will not bend, the Rurs unmanned reconnaissance strike system was also on display at the trade show. This wheeled robot reconnaissance vehicle weighs about 500 kilograms, has a speed of up to 80 kilometers an hour and can carry various weapons. The machine can be operated remotely at a distance of up to several kilometers and is equipped with an autonomous control system. For example, the first robot ensures protection of the second one, which transfers intelligence data, while the third carries out other activities. There's also a patrol operation mode for triggering automatic target destruction. If a reconnaissance robot is damaged or at risk of being captured by the enemy, a self-destruction system will be activated. This strike vehicle, or buggy, is another new piece of equipment developed for special reconnaissance units. Up to three people with all their equipment and gear for several days of autonomous operations can fit into it. The vehicle has a speed of up to 140 kilometers an hour and a fording depth of up to half a meter, while its height adjustable suspension ensures enhanced all-terrain capability. The buggy also has a weapons mount. In all, over 260 enterprises demonstrated their security products at the Defence Ministry's first Innovation Day.